Hey guys, welcome back to a new video on the channel. This video is going to be a build upon video upon the last video I did, and well, probably the last two videos, a link up there. How to create a vertical video and how to create a vertical video automatically. Now this one's going to be another requested video on the channel. Now if you have a certain request for the video, leave it down in the comments below now, and I'll be sure to do it. Anyway guys, welcome back to a new video on the channel. My name is Jack Furley, I'm a freelance videographer, photographer and video editor. And if you want to support the channel, link in the description, buy me a coffee, support the channel. So this video is how to create a square video. How do we actually create a square video for social media content? This one's a less more popular one, but it's still popular nonetheless. This one's more popular on, on social media such as Facebook and Instagram. So I jump straight into this. So, once you have your clip and once Premiere Pro is open, what you want to do is come down to here, same thing as last time. Come up to black video, and what we want to do is change the width and the height 1080 by 1080. And what that's going to do is create a little black video so we can actually create this and put it out on our social media. So, once you've done that, change your frame rate and whatever you filmed on. For me, I filmed on what did I film on? 30 frames per second. Leave it a square pixel, click OK, and then all you do is just drag it onto the timeline. And there you go, you've got your own little square video. And now, what you can do, I've got my Maroon 5 music video here. As you can see here, we've got our, obviously our little, nice little black square video that we can put on social media, but what you can do, you can also drag it in and resize it. But you can also drag it in and resize it so it goes to the correct aspect ratio. Or what you can do, if you want to create, still have the, the vertical one, but what you can do, if you don't want to mess around with that, you can come down and hit scale to frame size and reset these and what that's going to do is going to leave the top and bottom part on so you can create like a little progress bar or a little text or whatever you want to do, subtitles, whatever you want to do but that's how you create a square video in Adobe Premiere Pro guys anyway guys I hope you like the video, this is another requested video on the channel just a quick little one, I do quick little tutorials anyway if you want to support the channel, link in the description, go buy me a coffee the amount's up to you and if you have a requested video, leave in the comments and I'll sure get back to you anyway guys, thank you for watching the video and I'll see you on the next video Same thing.